while you look at this opportunity to get started tomorrow, what are two or three things that are going to be really important for you guys to execute on uh, throughout the course um, of the game? For tomorrow's matchup, communication and defense. Paul, you guys, I think you will force close to like 19 turnovers a game against the Warriors last year. They turned over a ton against show. What made y'all so successful against them in those four games in, in terms of in terms of forcing turnovers? Um, I think just physicality um, is one. Um, and then I think we did a great job just having the attention to detail. Um, they beat you off so many ways outside of them being, you know, great ISO players. Um, I think, you know, we they're going to make shots. Uh, that's, that's not what we're trying to do. Um, we know they're going to make shots. Um, we just got to take away the, the, the stuff where they can get easy baskets. Um, we forced them to take and make tough shots. Um, pat him on the butt and we'll go down on the other Well, you never know until you play, but, but right now, is there one thing or two things that you think, like, okay, this team's got this, we're going to be good at this, we know this is part of our identity? I think we have length, we have speed, we have quickness. Um, that's in our favor. That's one thing we're, we're really good as a unit. Um, so we got to use that to our advantage. Paul, do you think Russell's going to play tomorrow? I'm not sure. Y'all uh, got to ask Zero that. We don't get a chance to. <laughs> 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 gotta watch tomorrow night. <laughs> Contract. Well, you guys were dominant on the last, last season. Do you lose anything in the new personnel that way, or do you feel like you still can kind of own that area of the game? Yeah. Um, again, us being pretty lengthy, us being um, an athletic group, um, us having the best pound for pound rebounder um, in the game, um, you know, we should be, uh, we should still be. You know, very well offensively and defensively rebounding the ball. Is that an area you've got to excel in against this team because they're a little vulnerable on the glass? Absolutely, absolutely. But I think, you know, that's in our favor on both ends, uh, regardless of who we play. Um, <clears throat> I think the biggest scouting report against us is to, to hit the glass um, and, and, and tr try to secure the ball um, because, you know, who we have on our side. Um, you know, zeros, um, you know, the way he can get it and, and just create something out of nothing, you know, teams try to account for that. Um, and, and rebounding is an area where, you know, we got to be good at that. How do you feel about the start this year? Last year you were new, Melo was new. This year you, second year. Do you feel more at ease as far as where the team is now? Compared absolutely, to last year? absolutely. Um, you know, absolutely. I feel comfortable here, and, and I know what to expect and, and what's expected of me. So. What about the team? I mean, how do you feel the guys are? Yeah, I mean, we we. Outside of Melo being gone, Brew being gone, um, we've added some some new faces. But um, you know, we've added some guys, like Dennis Nerlens, who've you know been in the league for a little while now. Um, they're they're not guys trying to find identity and, and and find out who they are in this league. They know their games. Um, so in that aspect, we we've added some some veteran um, players. Uh, so they're up to speed. They know you know how we do thing, do things here. Um, I feel good about our, our group. Paul, they, for, uh, we haven't seen Abdul at all. You haven't seen him a ton, I know, because he hasn't practiced a lot. But what, what's been your impression of him early? He's a really good shooter. Um, Abdul is, is, is one of our, our better shooters. Um, he can really spread the floor. Doesn't need much time um, to get it off. Um, so that's a huge weapon, especially um, playing around me, playing around Russ, a guy that can stretch and spread the floor. Um, it's crucial. Paul. They do, the Warriors do a lot of guard, guard, screening off the ball, having a guy slip, having a guy pop out to three, especially with the new kind of hands-off defensive rules. What is going to be crucial for you guys to execute on defensively when they do uh, that type of action? Yeah, having communication. Um, we still got to pressure up. We still got to be aggressive. We still got to be physical, but we got to be smart. Um, again, that's, that comes down to just attention to detail, having awareness of where those guys are at. Um, and communicate, talking it out. Well, I heard, I think the first preseason game, I heard you tell one of the officials when they called you for one of those holds off the ball, you told them, I can't wait till I get those calls. People are going to be doing it. Mm -hmm. Is there a double edged sword there? You're, on one hand, yeah, you I mean, preseason, I've probably averaged, what, eight free throws yeah. a game? I've never averaged that. So uh, it's, it's coming into effect. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of like it? Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, you talked earlier about the, the, the quickness, the length, the speed. You guys have. I know, obviously, where you are now, you'll continue to evolve mm -hmm. as things get going here. How can you guys use those advantages now, and how do you see them evolving as this season goes on? Um, I think 
the more we can just create opportunities in, in fast break um, is to our advantage. <laughs> uh, the more we can get, especially when we can get a fast unit out there with myself, JG, uh, Russ, um, Dennis, uh, Nerlens or Steve-O, um, the, <laughs> the better we'll be. I think that's uh, opportunities that we can really quick strike. Um, and with that unit, you know, we can defend, we can get stops. I think that's the unit where we can really pile on points. Um, because we can play in a fast break, play in a, a transition game, um, change the tempo of the game up. Um, and, and defensively, I think we can really defend and switch out. And, um, you know, just be a problem on both ends. Thanks, PG. Thanks. Thank you, guys.